I want to go over a disclosure form so you can kind of get an idea of what to look for. Now you get this prior to making an offer and this should help you in making an offer. So let's just go over it real quick. Um, so you can see this is a disclosure from one of the houses we actually looked at. And so it starts off with when was the main house constructed? So what, what year was it built? 1984. Okay. Is the property vacant? The answer is yes. If, if yes, how long has it been since the property has been occupied? One week. So we know right off the bat that we, our offer should be thinking about the fact that they're not in the house anymore. So if they're not in the house anymore, they probably more are more willing to make a deal or negotiate on a price. So that's one thing we look at. Another thing too is um, it really depends on what state you're in, how much of the information is the same, but this should give you a good illustration of kind of how everything works. Okay, so so the next question is, is the property or, or any portion leased? The answer is no. So they're not leasing the property for anything. So you have to work. So you would have to worry about that if you were purchasing it and then somebody was leasing it and then you have to worry about them. So that's not that's not the issue. So it's not designated historic uh, district or anything like that. So that's good. Now this part two is covenants, fees, and assessments. Is a property subject to or recorded declaration of covenants? That means pretty much an HOA. So this is an HOA. And it's telling you if yes, then is there a community association? Yes. So it, there's probably going to be some sort of money that you have to pay to um, be a part of this homeowners, to, to own this home, I should say. And it's, it's going to, t it tells us to, you, they have to attach it so we know what we're getting into. So we read that too. Lead-based paint um, after 1978 or prior to 1978. This was 1984, so that's a no. Here's another thing we want to look at. Has there been any settling movement, cracking, or breakage of the foundations or structural supports of, of the improvements? No. Most of these are going to be no. But we, you want to read them all, but pay attention to the yeses because that's what's going to be a big thing. We want to make sure that nothing is, or, or not nothing, that we understand everything that we're getting into. So uh, you read these, no, no need notices, is any portion of the main dwelling mobile, modular, or manufactured. So all that's no, but if it was a yes, pay attention to it and also pay attention to the explanation for the yeses. Okay, so has any part of the HVAC system been replaced during seller's ownership? Now this is a big thing because we wanna know, these are the actual functional parts of the house. We wanna know how new it is. So for this one, this one was replaced in 2020. Good. That's, that's, that's a good thing. Okay. Uh, so the next question is, uh, is any heated or cooled portion of the main dwelling not served by a central heating and cooling system? And just know what they're basically saying is that is there any part of the house that is not on the actual HVAC system? And the answer is no. So like I said, pay attention to the yeses here because you want to make sure that you know what you're getting into. Read the whole thing, but pay attention to the yeses. All right. No, <laughs> here's another thing. Approximate age of the water heater, 20 years. Now, we know that water heaters last about 20 years. So, we, for this house, we asked for this to be replaced in our offer. Because we see that it's 20 years old. And we know that our, you know, house isn't going to be, this is probably going to conk out on us if we bought this house. Pretty soon. Okay, so it tells you drinking water source. Uh, it tells you it's a sewer system sometimes, it's a uh, septic tank, so you have to, there's some other issues that come along with septic tanks you have to be aware of, but this is a public sewer system, so that's, that's what it's on. Uh, let's see, I want to try to get to one where there's an explanation. Okay, here we go. Alright, so we want to look at the yeses. Has any part of the roof been repaired during seller's ownership? Yes. Uh, approximate age of the main building and roof, they weren't sure, because I think they had just bought the house, you know, three years prior, so the previous owner probably knew this but or maybe they didn't know it but you have to say if you do know it so they're not sure but this would happen to the house that was repaired or the roof that was repaired there was a storm that blew off a few shingles off so okay not a big deal but we're going to make sure we check that with the inspector because that's what's coming next the inspection all right so uh like i said pay attention to the yeses uh, these are all no's and then explanations yeses these are all no's. 
but you, like I said, you want to read. I want to go over really quickly with you, but you want to read everything. All right, any wildlife addict that's basically asking, is there any uh, squirrels who have nested that you that you know of? Things like that. No, no, no. Okay, so this is all nose, 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 nose. No, 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 no. So just read it, and this is basically what they look like. Um, it's going to give you, and here's another thing, the, the fixtures checklist. So this is everything that's coming with the house. So in this case, you're giving it a dishwasher sometimes. And if it's, it, it's checked, you read what it means, but for this one, if it's checked, it's staying. So the dishwasher staying, microwave oven, oven. And you'd be surprised what doesn't stay. Have you ever seen that movie, Moving, with Richard Pryor years and years ago? It's, it's a funny scene because <laughs> uh, the, the guy that they're buying a house from jokes about that he's taking everything and they want to get there. It's all gone. It's kind of funny. So if you have a chance, watch that. But take a look at what's coming, what's in, included. Um, so I'll let you know what you're getting. So this is all going to help us with our offer. Mm -hmm.